Hello and welcome to our virtual tour of our 2020 Toyota Land Cruiser 200 Series VX. A little bit about us here at Pacific Toyota Lexus of Cairns. I'm standing at one of two of our pre-owned vehicle yards where we go through just over 200 vehicles a month, making us Toyota's largest pre-owned vehicle department in Queensland. Now we've got our very own showroom where we photograph each and every vehicle that comes through onto the yard. And as you can see, quite a variety of vehicles. Across the street, brand new part of Toyota Lexus, parts and services just at the front there. And you make your way towards the city, you'll actually come across a second pre-owned vehicle yard as well. Throughout the video though, I'll go around the 200 series VX here in complete detail, pointing out any blemishes that may appear at first point of sale. So starting down around the front, just checking out the wheels, making sure there's no scratching or gutter rash, but also checking that we've got plenty of tire tread there. Now that's part of the roadworthy certificate, including that driveway price here in Queensland. But not only that, obviously the nice chunky all terrains. And as you can see, nice and tidy up on, underneath those wheel arches. Around the front, we've got the genuine Toyota bull bar. We've got the proximity sensors as well. Just making sure, hasn't copped any knocks. Nice and tidy. Up and underneath the front there for 4x4. Four four. You've also got the bonnet protector. And as we have a look across the bonnet, no dense stone chips and imperfections. Obviously, it's done its job beautifully. But you're also getting a great reflection of that pearlescent paint as well. Down the passenger side, nice straight bodywork. A couple of markings just there on the bull bar. But as we can see, nothing that's actually pushed through onto the bodywork. Nice and tidy on the panels. That passenger front, and no scratching. Plenty of tire tread. Nice and clean up and underneath those arches. But as we make our way down that passenger side, Keep an eye out for any little markings and imperfections. It's been a nice, tidy, straight bodywork. Got a little dent just in there on the chrome part. A little marking just there. Looks to be a little bit of dirt coming off. But overall, very tidy. No dings or dents. No scratching or imperfections. That passenger rear, again, scratch free, plenty of tread as well. So great to see that consistency as we're making our way around the vehicle. So we come around the back and just keep an eye out for any knocks or imperfections. Tow bus set up with the wiring system just here. Oops, there, there we are. Underneath as well, but as you can see, no markings or chips or anything out of the rear bar here. While we're back here, we'll have a look inside. And you've also got the rubber boot mat as well. I'm trying to hide anything, just being well looked after. Let's have a look at the seats, still in great condition. No wear and tear or imperfections through the back. Down the driver's side, again, keep covering each panel as we go. Nice and tidy. That fourth and final wheel, just like the rest. Now, normally, you see some marks on the inside. The driver's door here. This one, okay, you got a little mark just down the bottom there. It's usually one of the most common spots you'll see a little imperfection, um, especially when there's not many to point out around the vehicle. I do like to cover that part in the video. But as we can see, it's been kept in excellent condition. Have a look across the roof. Obviously got the sunroof, but making sure there's no dings, dents or hail damage. And getting great reflection off that paint all the way around the vehicle. Through the interior, making sure there's no wear and tear, scratching or scuff marks. The carpet floor mats through here again, making sure it's not hiding anything. The leather seating still in excellent condition. And down here you've got the towing kit. Just over here 
and then in this little cover is that plastic cover for the rear there as well so good to see both are still in the vehicle but all your air conditioning controls up on the roof there as well your lights your vents still in good condition you got the uh, weather shields on the front as well and now through the driver's door obviously the most commonly used it's only wear and tear, it is likely to show up on this one first. But again, looks to be very tidy. Here you got the rubber floor mats up front. Driver's seat still in excellent condition. Just make sure that everything's working. Beautiful, no hidden noises or sound of sand in the runs or anything like that, which is always good. Uh, we'll jump in and we'll start her up. You got the two keys. Push button start on the left hand side. Beautiful. Down on the right hand side though, you got anything from your proximity sensors, your DPF, your side mirrors, your red arc control there. It's all been set up already. If you make a way across, you got your cruise control and on the right hand side to do with the little display screen up above. And as we have a look, 47,516 kilometers. We'll check that authenticity shortly with the service history. Digital speedo, you can flick through, set that up as you please, or your fuel consumptions and everything. And on the left hand side, obviously to do with your Bluetooth, your hands free. Uh, obviously a bit more once the phone's connected. But you got the nice large touchscreen display. As you can see, you got the built-in maps. Jump back home, make sure the touchscreen's working and everything. Um, but it's also where that reverse camera shows up out the back. Give you great vision on the rear bar, but also you got that 360 camera as well. Make your way down, you've got your dual climate control, air conditioning, a couple of controls for the stereo, the USB port and AUX just there. But then you've got all your four-wheel drive controls and like, like them all nowadays in an automatic. But up front, nice and tidy, a couple little wear and tear markings on the interior just there. Very minor, but I do like to point them out still. As we have a look inside though, the vehicle looks to have been very well looked after inside and out. No fading, cracking or stickiness on the dash. We'll have a look and just make sure everything's working, the sunroof and all. Beautiful. Have a look inside, make sure we've got all the books, the service history, the main one people do want to know about. So we'll have a bit of a flick through. Service at 10,000 Ks there at a Toyota. 13,000 at a Toyota. 20,000 at a Toyota again. 27,000 at a Toyota. 36,000 at a Toyota. 42,000 at a Toyota. And 47,000 at Toyota, which is us here in Cairns. So full Toyota service history, all up to date. Looks like it's been very well looked after with the engine as well. And only 57,000 is when the next service is due, giving you a good bit of time. Last but not least, we'll have a look underneath the bonnet while she's running. Obviously make sure there's no hidden noises. Beautiful, nice and easy with the shocks on the side. But as we have a look through, no rust or red dust, very clean and tidy. And as we listen to it run, no knocks, rattles or squeals, is that V8 motor ticking over nicely. But that was a virtual tour of our 2020 Toyota Land Cruiser 200 Series VX. Hope you enjoyed and look forward to hearing from you soon. Thank you.